they let us have it. I feel like I say this every vlog. We worked with California closets. <laughs> Excuse me. $300 just in fertilizer. Being fatties. First Aperol spritz. Look at him zooming. I'm just not with it today. Say hi. Oh. I don't know what he's doing back there. I'm just not with it today. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Megan. If you're new here, I meant to start this video so much earlier. I just like forgot. I've been like a zombie today. It's like a cold, windy fall day. My office is just so like calming and peaceful and I'm just sitting here like I could fall asleep. Today is Friday. Today is the conclusion of my first week in my new job and it went really well i'm really happy i know this job is going to be not a, not a challenge necessarily but like push me to challenge myself a little bit more i definitely feel like a higher up i'm not technically a higher up but i definitely feel a little bit more like in charge of like what's going on at work and stuff it's been really good yeah i'm just like really like I'm not necessarily tired, I just feel like brain dead. Like does that make any sense? I do need to show you guys our closets. I'm currently editing a video, it's from March. Oh, I did get this cup. I don't know how I feel about it. I think I like the flow of my Hydro Flask better. Like I think I like drinking out of my Hydro better, but I did need another cup of this size to force myself to wash this because I never run the lid through the dishwasher. Okay, I'm gonna log off my work computer and then I kinda wanna go make, I finally have all the ingredients for an Aperol spritz and I really wanna go make one. I, it's literally September and I have never had an Aperol spritz so this girl needs to go make one. Oh, a bunch of girls. Okay, I'm gonna go downstairs. I feel like the sun is so bright. Oh my gosh, look how pretty this is. I feel like I say this every vlog, but you have to look. Look how pretty it is. And I put these lanterns here. I just ordered the other candles for it to go in that one. Um, when I was at Target, the only one they had was that. I'm gonna go make this Aperol spritz. Here we go, actually, let me show you. Oh wait, Matt's cutting grass. <laughs> but I'll show you guys the wreath I put on the door. Look at him zooming. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Who's waving now? Who's outside? Oh, a car. <laughs> Look at him go. <laughs> Put this wreath on the door. I think it looks good. I don't really know. You like the wreath? Good, you like it? <laughs> Oh, look at this sunlight. I need to get my phone to take a picture. The sunlight looks so good. But you guys see this? Um... There we go. That's it. <laughs> oh, yeah. <gasps> Wait. I, okay. I have so many things to show you guys. I feel like a chaos. Okay. I had a setting when I was recording that last clip. I don't know what happened with the focus. But, okay. Look at this. Three, two, one. Boom. Look at this. This is beautiful. So this mirror, so if I told you guys, this dining room set came from Matt's uncle's mother. She passed away right after Christmas and Matt's uncle had to clean out her house. It was a whole thing. And so his aunt and uncle gave us this set. And then this was something else I had wanted, but they were having an estate sale with the house and they, they kind of wanted to see like if they could sell this for like a lot of money. Um, it ended up not selling, so then they let us have it. Matt's family is so nice. <gasps> a fly. I love this angle. I feel like I'm, I feel like I have ADHD right now. <laughs> okay, this angle is stunning. I knew I really wanted a mirror in this dining room. We have such a, just a big wall over there. Uh, eventually we're gonna put Wayne's coating up, I think, and some crown molding, but this just looks stunning to me. The chandelier is from Home Depot, but I think it looks like really nice. I think Wayfair does, or in anywhere else you can buy, like whatever, wherever you buy your light fixtures. I'm pretty sure there are like bigger ones. You know, this one's a five candle one. I know that there's like six candle. I'm sure there's an eight candle one, uh, but we just have the five candle. I didn't want to get one that was too big for the room, but I love that you can see the reflection in the mirror. I think it looks 
stunning. Just ignore all the junk on the table. I think all of our mail is in here, just piles of crap. I think I showed you guys last weekend, these table, what do you, what do you call this, placemat? These placemats are from Target. They match the table runner I put in our kitchen. I was messing around with some taper candles. Oh, I put some pumpkins here. Those look really nice. I love the colors this year that Target has for all their stuff. They have a lot of like deeper greens, um, creams, and then they also have like a really like bold orange color. But let me show you guys. Ta-da! Okay, it looks a little junky right now because I just threw everything in here, but this is insane. Like we actually have shelving now. So I'll explain everything. Um, if you guys don't know, we worked with California Closets to get this installed. We had design guy come out back in June, I'm pretty sure. We sat down with him, you know, we showed him the house, showed him the areas we wanted um, to get, you know, designed. They then use like this online program that they have and they like replicate the exact dimensions of your room. They make it like they, the program, like they pick the wall color, the floor, everything to make it look just like your room. And then they'll go in and they'll design it like how they see it working best for you. Like you say kind of like what you're looking for, what are you looking to use the space for, blah, blah, blah. And then they'll go in, design it for you, show it to you. They show you all these renderings. They're insanely cool. And then you schedule your construction date, whatever, and they come out and they literally just build it for you, like in your house. It's expensive, um, I will say, but it was cheaper than the other company that we had come out. So obviously like this is the laundry room. You come in from the garage right here. So this we knew we needed storage for like our cleaning supplies, our laundry stuff, vacuum, whatever, shoes. So these shelves here are skinnier because they're all for shoes. This is a little basket for like flip-flops or slides or whatever. You can just throw tons in here, which is so nice. I love that I can just open it with my foot too. Like I don't have to bend down. It slides super nicely. These are all for shoes. And then these shelves starting here are a little bit taller. So these fit some cleaning supplies, whatever. You, we could even store extra food in here if we needed. All of our paper towels we threw up there. Um, it actually does even fit all my <laughs> alcohol. Um, that's not all gonna stay in here. I'm eventually gonna get like a cabinet that I'm gonna keep all this stuff in in my dining room But for now we don't have that just so many shelves these spray bottles. These do not fit in here Like these are too tall, but they do fit in here, which is perfect It fits all of the laundry stuff like these are like the jumbo bottles from BJ's these two they fit perfect We love it. I'm so happy and then for the sink, we're going to get a new utility sink eventually. This one's just really junky. But they put a drying rack or like a bar, like a, a hanging bar above the sink for anything that has to drip dry. We can just hang it right over the sink and it can drip right into the sink and not have to worry about it. And then for over here, same concept. I could hang wet laundry over here, which is like amazing because Matt hang dries a lot of his clothes so I can just hang it right in here and not worry about it. And then we can also, if we wanted to, we can hang up our coats in here. We could even do like hooks back here on the wall if we wanted to like utilize hanging coats that way. And then underneath here, we're gonna get a storage bench, eventually the kind that flips up. So we can store more stuff inside that and then we can like sit on it, put our shoes on, whatever. And then up here, this is gonna be like, I'll, I'll get like those little cloth bins and then we can put all of our hats and scarves and stuff in there. So really freaking excited about this. I love it. I can show you guys our master too, but I do wanna get my phone and take a picture of the front door while the sun looks really good. I'm nervous about this. How do you, I've never done this before. Oh, it's already coming out. Is it gonna, oh shoot, I guess you do this on the deck just in case. It's coming out. I just don't know if it's gonna pop. Oh. Okay. That went far. <laughs> I made it. I survived. The cork flew off the Prosecco. Here it is. I put it in like a ginormous. <laughs> I think this is like a wide body red wine glass, but you know. It's so good.
First Aperol spritz ever. Okay, it's so dark now. I am gonna go start dinner. Matt is still outside, but I, what we've learned with HelloFresh, oh, my SD card ran out. Like I was saying, is that with HelloFresh, we've learned that it'll say that it takes like so many minutes to prep and then cook, but like for us, it takes way longer. So I'm gonna go and start prepping dinner i'm sure matt wants to be like a part of it but i don't want to like wait until he comes inside to start it's literally so dark He's doing back there. It's like eight in the morning. We're back home now. Um, I got a pumpkin spice latte. Went to the grocery store too after Lowe's, and the Starbucks in the grocery store was closed. But luckily, there's a Target right next door to our grocery store that also has a Target, so everyone was going in there. We got all these nice new solar lights at Lowe's. I'm just like taking all the stickers off now. Went to the grocery store, gotta put the groceries away. We got like six bags of lawn fertilizer and seed. It was like like $300 just in fertilizer, so it's expensive stuff. Here we go. Bailey. That's it. Well then, kiss me. So that's, I don't know how to do it. Can you give me light, please? <laughs> give me your phone. I thought you would have had your phone in your no, pocket. No, I don't have my phone in my pocket. I think it should light itself now, but... Very nice. Look at that. Do you love it? That's awesome. Pretty cool, ain't it? Yeah, it's very nice. Where's the glass pieces for it? They're in my parents' house. Oh. Being fatties. Oh yeah. How many days in a row is this? <laughs> uh, three. <laughs> Can you take it from my hand, please? Just put it on the couch. Thank you. <gasps> look who's here! Ellen, look here. No. We're not going outside. <gasps> Hi, Mr. Baby. Well, now you want to come. What are you doing? What's wrong? <laughs> Excuse me. What are you doing, girl? Bailey. <gasps> Say hi. No, he's so busy with his ball. Like Yo. What was in the cell? The soft packet. The cream. Uh. <laughs> I don't think I've talked to the camera all day today. 
been on the channel for like an hour and a half. Like I know that's like, I look really red. Okay, so I look less red in here. I ran for two miles, I think here. And I did 12, 3.30 at first, but like my treadmill only goes up to incline 10. So I did incline 10 for 30 minutes on a speed of three. And it didn't like feel that bad. And then I ran a mile and then I walked a little and then I ran another mile. So I'm feeling good. It's like 9.30, I need to go take a shower and go to bed. And I start work tomorrow at seven, so. And then Matt and I are going back to his parents' house tomorrow, so yeah. I need to let my hair dry though because I don't have my hair dryer here. So I'm gonna have to air dry it as best I can. It's like pouring rain here again. It's like been pouring on and off all day. It's kind of been like a nice lazy Sunday. Mm -hmm. 